Tonight, the Central Dauphin School Board voted to bring back students for full in-person learning in a phased approach starting October 13th. The move comes despite opposition. WGAL News 8's Danielle Woods was there. Drivers honk their horns to show their support for the teachers rallying outside of Central Dauphin East High School Monday night. The group was calling on the district to stick with its hybrid learning model. We just want safe working conditions and learning environments for everybody. That's also what Liz Potter wants. She's a teacher in the district with more than 30 years of experience. This year is much different than anything I ever expected. She's also the co-president of the Central Dauphin Education Association, and she says members of the group also want things to stay how they are now. We did a survey of our members and over half of the people responded and 85% of them said that they would favor the hybrid model that we're currently in to continue for a little longer. Mr. Mr. Thompson? Yes. yes. But in the end, the school board yeah. had the final say. It voted six to two to start a phased full reopening for students in the district, bringing back students K through five starting October 13th. We will definitely support whatever um, we're asked to do, but we are just very concerned about the population increase and the cleanliness. We need to have clear communication and what does it look like? How do how do we do mask breaks? How do we keep everyone safe? Danielle Woods, WGAL News 8. The board says middle and high school students will return fully in person learning in the coming months. The board also stressed there are options for families with children of all grades.